Welcome to the first Rokid offline flagship store in the world. We are gathered here today for the Rokid Open Day. Rokid holds two major events each year. The first is Rokid Jungle, held in the middle of each year, and the second is Open Day, held at the beginning of each year. Rokid Jungle is an event dedicated to interacting with our users. During this event, we usually talk about our new product releases and share our thoughts on future and current projects as well as what we've learned from interacting with users. Open Day is another event where we can communicate with you on a deeper, more technological level as well as fully demonstrate every aspect of the product capabilities. Open Day is a special day mainly dedicated to communicating with the industry, our partners and developers. During this event, you can see things that can't be seen at the product level, things at a deeper level, and of course, we'll also launch new products. This year's Rokid Open Day is full of exciting content waiting for you. So we won't keep you in suspense any longer. On this year's Rokid Open Day, we will show you Rokid Air's next generation product, Rocket Max. Let's check out the amazing Rokid Max promo video. How about Rokid that? Is Isn't Rokid Max amazing? I believe this year's Rokid Max release will cause some heated discussions throughout the industry and even set a new benchmark for the industry. Now that everyone's curious about Rokid Max's technology and design, without further ado, I'd like to invite Shia Kai, Head of Product Design at the Hardware Design Center, to give you a more detailed introduction on Rokid Max's features. Hello everyone, my name is Shia Kai and I'm an industrial designer here at Rokid. I'm here to show you our new generation of AR glasses. In the past, Rokid Air achieved an outstanding level of comfort and audiovisual experience among industry peers and received excellent market feedback. But we will never stop striving for perfection. The popularity of Rokid Air has meant higher user expectations. We've put our thoughts and predictions for future products together. 
and created our new generation of AR glasses, called Rocket Max. As AR glasses are a wearable device, reducing their size and weight is always on our minds. So how small and light is Max then? We used a fully customized optical module to reduce the size of Max to an astonishing 18.5 millimeters, which may be the smallest size among AR glasses with the same optical scheme in the industry. We redesigned the hinge, optimized the Type-C adapter board, and made every detail as small as possible. In short, we got rid of any excessive space and material. The Max experience stands out by far in the industry with its smaller size, optimized structure, and customized modules. As a result, Max weighs even less than air. With an astonishing weight of only 75 grams, Max might be the lightest among AR glasses with the same optical scheme. In addition to decreasing the weight, after many versions and changes to the design, we achieved the perfect balance between intelligence and aesthetics ensuring that the temples of the glasses will fit any head shape. Plus, with improved hinges that don't put excessive pressure on your head, the glasses are very comfortable to wear. Even after extreme weight reduction, we have greatly improved the visual effects. Rokid Max uses Sony Semiconductor Solutions Corporation's panel for sharper picture quality and has a display area 50% larger than that of the previous generation as well as a super-wide FOV of 50 degrees. That's equivalent to a 215-inch borderless display 6 meters away. It also supports a high refresh rate of up to 120 Hz. And, thanks to continuous optimization by optical engineers, every corner of Max's display is super clear. Max also has Tuv Einland Eye Comfort Certification, the world's most comprehensive eye protection test for XR. This way, on top of superior visuals, users enjoy all-around eye protection. The perceived brightness is 400 nits. The maximum brightness is 600 nits. This is double that of the Rokid Air, and also 20% higher than mainstream products in the industry. Max continues to use the widely acclaimed diopter adjustment design. This time, we expanded the adjustment range to zero to 600 degrees. But that's not all. Thanks to the hard work of our structural and optical engineers, diopter adjustment has been greatly optimized. Adjusting the diopter will not shrink the picture. It will maintain a FOV of 50 degrees, which is a huge improvement. This way, people with different eyesight can enjoy the same widescreen experience. Considering users with more than 600-degree myopia will also provide frame accessories for nearsighted people. Max acoustic effects have been greatly improved as well. Let me show you. This is the frequency response curve comparing Rokid Max with mainstream audio glasses. Blue is Huawei, yellow is Bose, and gray is our Rokid Max. The trends of the three are almost matching, meaning the sound quality is essentially on the same level. Simply from an audio point of view, Rokid Max can be compared with the most professional audio manufacturers. With exceptional directional sound quality, a headset should provide you with utmost audio privacy. How good is Max of privacy then? Let me show you a picture. You'll be able to watch movies or football games while wearing Rokid Max without disturbing your family, even if they're sleeping next to you. As a married man, I was quite impressed by this feature, but is that enough? Max uses the most advanced optical polarizing film technology to reduce front light leakage by 90%, giving you privacy without exceptions. Let's imagine you take Rokid Max to watch movies in a train station or airport. As long as you don't get too involved in whatever you're watching, nobody will even know. There was one pain point involved in using Chinese AR glasses abroad. After the glasses were connected to the phone, some films and TV shows could be played directly on the glasses due to digital copyrights. As a solution, our supply chain and R&D colleagues worked hard to incorporate HDCP support into Rokid Max, probably making them the only AR glasses in China that support HDCP. This ensures that foreign films and TV shows can be played without barriers.
Now we can bring an excellent audiovisual experience to audiences around the world. Next, let's focus on a very interesting feature of the product. These are three people who vary in terms of gender, skin color, body type, and personality. If they wear the same glasses, do you guys feel something is off here? In the future, AR glasses will be regarded not only as a tech product, but also as an accessory reflecting each person's individual taste and self-perception. It'd be so disappointing if each brand offered only one style. Despite its small size, Max offers room for customization, allowing users to choose different blackout covers to create their own exclusive Rokin Max glasses. We'll also be partnering with various brands on custom blackout covers, giving users more personalized choices. Finally, let me introduce the accessories. A double-ended Type-C cable is generally about 5 mm in diameter. We reduced the diameter of our previous generation Rokin Air's cable to 3.5 mm. But this still wasn't enough for our engineers. After a lot of verification and testing, our engineers reduced Max's cable diameter to a staggering 2.7 mm. This may be the thinnest double-ended Type-C cable for AR glasses on the market. With its 2.7 mm diameter and skin-friendly material, it's a perfect match for the Max glasses making the experience as seamless as it gets. To sum it all up, Max offers an ultra-wide FOV of 50 degrees, which is equivalent to a 215-inch, 120 hertz borderless display 6 meters away, 400 nit perceived brightness, a 75-gram weight, and lossless image adjustment for 0 to 600 degrees of myopia. It perfectly balances performance and aesthetics. It supports HDCP to ensure foreign films and TV shows without restrictions. It prevents 90% of front light leakage for the utmost privacy and boasts an enhanced 9-axis INU, 3DOF, head control, and other interaction methods, stunning top-quality sound effects, a bilinear noise reduction mic, and support for voice commands. It supports seamless switching between 2D and 3D and has a 2.7 mm ultra-thin cable. Plus, with customized designs, each user can create their own exclusive Rokid Max. This amazing product embodies our many years of hardware R&D and extreme product brainstorming, as well as our exploration of an enthusiastic investment in the future. We look forward to bringing you more pleasant now, surprises in the future. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Shia Kai. Just now, you saw a complete presentation of Max, and you can see that Max is not just an upgrade of Rokid Air, but a foray into a brand new realm. I believe that the comprehensive exploration Rokid has done and the targets we've hit, as well as our way of thinking, will constitute a new pinnacle in the industry. And I believe Max will impress all of our peers. You can see Max's impressive ultra-high-definition picture quality and large screen. It all leaves a deep impression. At the moment, its visual experience is one of the best on the market, so you can enjoy every pixel of the picture, even on the edges. One evolutionary upgrade we've made is enabling adjustment for myopia without affecting image size and quality. We also paid extra attention to privacy protection, so Rokid Max will definitely bring you a lot of pleasant surprises. So, today is not only about Max, as we have other surprises too. Max is a product that connects the past and future, as we have migrated all the original features of the traditional multimedia era, like watching movies, playing games, and working, into the new AR glasses. This is a product that really connects the past and future. We talk a lot about AR devices and other things related to AR. But in reality, a lot of people are still having doubts about Rokid Max and Air. Are Rokid Max and Air true AR products? Here's the answer. Actually, it might be a bit confusing for many people in the industry. During our many years of experience, we fully concentrated on creating true AR products, meaning today we can present an authentic AR experience with the operating system we're calling Yoda OS Master. The following operations will be demonstrated using Rokid Max Pro. 
Welcome to the AR world created by Yoda OS Master. Right now we can see that the camera's picture is in black and white. In order to allow the master to process AR algorithms faster and deliver a smoother AR experience, our engineers gave Rokid Max Pro a super large camera with a grayscale lens. It sees everything in black and white. So how can we make it show us the information we want? In the virtual world, we just need to stretch out our hand and the picture will appear in front of our eyes. Let me show you. Let's open two pictures. These are the pictures our designer sent me this morning. We will select some of them as pre-installed pictures in our app and put them in the album. Let's open this one first. This movement effect is not bad. Let's put it aside and use it later. Now let's open the other one. This image is also looking pretty good. Let's put it aside. Now we can save both of them in the system. Our work here is already half done, so we can take a break and play a video. Let's open this Cloud TV app and check if our favorite animations were updated. This is quite interesting. Let's click to open it and take a look. Let's make it full screen. Here, we want to emphasize that we hope the scenery application isn't just known as a resource manager in the AR era. It not only allows users to locally upload files such as pictures, videos, audio files, and models, but also helps users quickly publish them on public resource platforms for others to use. We hope this application can manage the digital assets of users. The Yoda OS Master System offers all these features and does it with just one camera. We have integrated SLAM technology, gesture interaction, six DOF spatial audio and other technologies into the Master, hoping that it can bring users a brand new AR spatial audio visual experience. There is still one area we haven't covered yet, and that is content sharing. The images we capture are black and white. So how can we enable our users to see a more immersive picture? Well, we've created a new SDK tool for mixed reality recording. Through this tool, our users can quickly share content with friends or on social media, sharing happy moments with everyone. Next, I'd like to invite my colleague Dumka to help me demonstrate the mixed reality recording function. What we're presenting now is a batch of digital artwork provided by VR artist Kudalvis, and now we need to quickly place it in the flagship store. First, we need to drag the model list to the side of the exhibition space and select a model from the list. Now let's drag it to the exhibition space and choose another model. Now let's adjust the position of one of them. So we have placed two models in this exhibition space. If we place our hands on both sides of the model at the same time and enlarge it, the model will also be enlarged. We can also select an edge of this model to rotate and change its orientation. Okay, now for this model. Now both of the models have been perfectly placed in this exhibition space. This wraps up the demonstration. Thanks for the introduction of DevGong. As you all can see, this is a new operating system built around AR we focused on five aspects, perception, understanding, interaction, collaboration, and digital creation to create a whole new interpretation. We've optimized and upgraded many aspects of master, such as the chip, hardware design, operating system, data flow, software architecture, and authoring tools. This makes it a brand new fully equipped AR operating system. What exactly can master do? Everyone is really interested in this. Over the past few years, Rokin has been creating products in the digital culture space. We've done a lot of research and carry out projects in museums, scenic areas, and digital cities. Based on Master, what kind of all-new experience can we bring to our peers and partners in this field? Let's invite Zhao Weiqi, product manager in the digital culture department, to show you some of our new capabilities. 
Hello, everyone. I'm Joe Weichi, and today I am delighted to announce that we launched our new product, Rocket AR Experience Studio, called Ling Jing. You may have seen many AR spatial experiences online and offline. In the AR glasses field, it may take several months or even more than half a year to create such a spatial experience. From our first day of working with AR, we've been hoping to enable our customers, users, partners, and developers to quickly and conveniently bring the virtual world into the physical one. That's why we created Lingjing. It offers a powerful set of tools and engines that help shorten the total time it takes to create an AR spatial experience to a week or even a few days. It takes five simple steps to create an AR spatial experience. Scan the space with a phone, reconstruct the space in the cloud, edit the space online, and publish it to multiple devices with one click so we can access it on the phone and the glasses. Now, I'd like to invite my colleagues to demonstrate the process. He's currently capturing spatial data with his phone. After sparse and dense mapping and texture mapping in the cloud, it will go to multiple devices. After a while, the entire space can be rebuilt and clearly seen on the devices. Next, my colleague will put on glasses and place some 3D models into this space. For example, take the 3D model of Rokit IP. Through the system capabilities of Yoda OS Master, we can use voice and gestures to smoothly place any model in any position. We can also place custom 3D text in the space or use a 3D brush in the air. We also support 6 for creating a new AR audiovisual experience. All data will be uploaded to the cloud for synchronization. Next, I will put on another pair of glasses. You can now see that we both entered the same space. Here, I can see all the creations my colleagues are doing in this space. Langing has completed the data synchronization between the cloud and multiple terminals. Multiple users can then collaborate and interact in the same space. We use such a simple method to bring AR into the UGC era for everyone to enjoy. Langing uses five simple steps to allow everyone to create their own AR space. What kind of awesome applications can you create within the UGC cloud? What kind of innovative applications can industry experts create? The answer is up to you. Thank you, Weichi, for this great introduction. Lingjing is an unprecedented product in the AR industry. In fact, in the past, if we wanted to create AR, we needed professionals and specialist equipment for data capturing, editing, and so on. Now, our brand new Lingjing product can allow everyone to participate in AR creation. You only need an ordinary mobile phone and an ordinary computer to scan the space, generate a digital map online, and then edit and publish the content. Published content can then be used on different devices. It can be displayed on mobile phones, tablets, and of course on our AR glasses, making Lingjing an extremely significant epoch-making product. Lingjing enables everyone to participate in digital content creation in the AR era. Well, as you can see, being such a revolutionary product, it will have a profound impact on the entire industry. Now it's time to finally reveal Rokid Max's price and how you can buy the Rokid products we've shown you today. We don't want to keep people guessing any longer. So here we go. As a refresher, Today we've presented Max Pro, Station Pro, and some capabilities of our new operating system. For Rokid Max Pro, we will be providing more support to the developers. We will announce our detailed business plan later this year. So what price can you put on Rokid Max? Rokid Max is available starting now at a pre-order price of $439. You can now place an order on our official website. This open day exists for us to share our explorations and top achievements in technology with you. In addition, in the middle of this year, we'll be holding our Rokid Jungle event. What kind of surprises do you think we'll have for you then? Stay tuned!
Thank you all for coming. And see you soon.